Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem of simplify square root of 150 plus square root of 25 over square root of 150 minus square root of 25. Now, solution. To solve this problem, we have two methods. So let's call this method 1. Now, from here, in the numerator, this square root of 150 is same as square root 150, it is 6 times 25. We want to make 20, square root of 25 in common, then plus this square root of 25. Then over here, in the denominator, square root of 150 is same as square root of 150, it is 6 times 25 then minus this square root of 25 then it will be equal to into here square root of 6 times 25 we separate so it will be square root of 6 times square root of 25 then plus square root of 25 so here plus square root of 25 then over into here we separate square root of 6 times 25 is same as square root of 6 times square root of 25 then minus square root of 25 then in the next step it will be equal to into here in the numerator square root of 25 is common so we factorize we take out square root of 25 out of bracket now this here divided by square root of 25 it is this which is square root of 6 then plus this divided by this it is one bracket then over in the denominator square root of 25 is common so factorize we take out square root of 25 out of bracket this here divided by square root of 25 it is this square root of 6 then minus this divided by this it is one bracket then to simplify this square root of 25 will cancel this square root of 25 now from this divided by this we rationalize the denominator so into the denominator we multiply by square root of 6 here we have minus so it will be plus this one so we multiply this in the denominator and this in the numerator so also in the numerator we multiply by this square root of 6 plus 1 bracket then it will be equal to square root of 6 plus 1 times square root of 6 plus 1 is square root of 6 plus 1, then bracket square. Then over, in the denominator square root of 6 minus 1 times square root of 6 plus 1, this times this is in the form of a minus b bracket times a plus b bracket, which is equal to a square minus b square so a square it will be square root of 60 square so here square root of 60 square then minus b square it will be 1 square which is still 1 then it will be equal to from here in the numerator square root of 6 plus 1 bracket square this part here is in the form of a minus here we have plus so it will be a plus b bracket square which is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square then we'll apply this form of a square it will be square root of 60 square so here square root of 60 square then plus 2ab it will be 2 times square root of 6 times 1 so here times square root of 6 times 1 then plus b square it will be one square which is still one then over in the denominator this square root will cancel with square so it will be six minus one it is five then it will be equal to from here this square root will cancel with square so it will be six six we add with this one here so it will be seven then plus this two times one is two two times six it will be 2 square root of 6 then over this 5 so 7 
plus 2 square root of 6 over 5. This is our final answer. Or, to solve in another method from our problem, let's write our problem here, which is square root of 150 plus square root of 25 over square root of 150 minus square root of 25. Now, into this method, we'll start by rationalizing this denominator. So, into the denominator, we'll multiply by square root of 150, which is this. Here we have minus, so here yeah, it will be plus this square root of 25. Then also in the numerator, we multiply by this square root of 150 plus square root of 25. Then it will be equal to square root of 150 plus square root of 25 times this, this and this they are the same. So it will be square root of 150 plus square root of 25 then bracket square then over in the denominator square root of 150 minus here we have square root of 150 plus so this times this is in the form of a perfect square so it will be square root of 150 square so here square root of 150 square then minus square root of 25 square Then in the next step, it will be equal to from square root of 150 plus square root of 25 bracket square. This numerator here is in the form of a plus b bracket square, which is equal to a square plus 2ab plus b square. So a square, it is this square root of 150 square. So here it is square root of 150 square. Then plus 2ab, it will be 2 times a is this square root of 150 times b is this square root of 25. Then plus b square, it is this square root of 25 square. Then over, in the denominator, this square root will cancel square, so it will be 150, then minus this square root will cancel this square, so it will be minus 25. Then it will be equal to, from here, this square root will cancel this square, so it will be 150, then plus 2. Square root of 150 is same as square root of 150, it is 6 times 25. So it will be square root of 6 times square root of 25. Then times this here, square root of 25. Then plus, here, this square to cancel square, so it will be plus 25. Then over, in the denominator, 150 minus 25, it is 125. Then it will be equal to 150 plus 150 plus 25, it is 175. Then plus 2, Square root of 25, it is 5, so times 5 times this square root of 25, it is 5, so it, then times this here, square root of 6, then over this 125. Then it will be equal to 175 plus 2 times 5, it is 10, 10 times 5, it is 50, so it will be 50 times this square root of 6, then over this 125. Then in the next step, it will be equal to into here. And here, we factorize 25. So we take 25 out of bracket. 175 divided by 25, it is 7. Plus 50 divided by 25, it is 2. Then times this square root of 6 bracket, then over this 125. Then it will be equal to, here to simplify, 25 divided by 25 is 1, 125 divided by 25, it is 5. So it will be this, 7 plus 
2 square root of 6 over 5. So this is the simplified form, same as the answer in the first method. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.